Hey everyone, uh, this is Gleb Bakhmutov and I want to show you how to instrument an application that uses React scripts. I just scaffolded a new application using Create React App that uses React scripts under the hood. Every time I want to run something, I'll use yarn start, which runs React scripts start. So let's see how it looks. Yarn start, which by default opens a browser loads my website, which is just a React application. Imagine I want to have code coverage in this application. So what I will do, I will use this little package that we have written. It's called Cypress Instrument CRA. And what I will do, I will just add it to my project. So let me go to a terminal, paste the command, yarn add Cypress slash Instrument CRA. Okay, so I just installed the package. I have to actually add it to my start command. React scripts, just like a node, allows you to preload or pre-require a module before you run the rest of the commands. So in this case, I'll say Cypress slash instrument CRA, the name of NPM module I just installed. So this way, when React script starts, it will first load that module and then load the rest of the application. Let's see what the changes are. I'll start application again, runs it in the browser, but now check what happens. I open DevTools and now if I go to window, there's a new object called coverage with underscores. And now you can see that all my source code that was loaded is automatically instrumented by the instrument CRA. It literally finds the Webpack options React Scripts uses and adds one more bubble plugin Istanbul that instruments the source code on the fly. Each, each object has all the statements from the source code and has a counter of how many times each statement, each function and each branch, or in this case no branches, were executed when this application ran. That's it. My application is now instrumented, so we'll see how to get a coverage report in a later videos. Bye-bye.